In 2012, Greece launched Operation Senior Zeus. The operation aimed to capture irregular migrants and remove them from the streets and parks of the largest cities in Greece. Instead, the migrants were put into detention facilities before deporting them to their national country, but now Doctors Without Borders sound the alarm. Doctors Without Borders have been active in Greece since 2008, working with migrants and refugees. As the only organization allowed into the detention facilities, Doctors Without Borders have documented horrific living conditions for the thousands of refugees and migrants housed in police stations and so-called pre-removal centers. During this time working in detention centers, we have been seeing also that more than 65% of the medical problems that we have been addressing were created or related to the detention. Not to talk about mental health problems, people are fleeing countries in a war situation, they're fleeing Afghanistan, they're fleeing Somalia, they're fleeing Congo, they're going out of Syria, they have facing, they're facing difficult situation in their way to, to, to reach Europe, and then they face a situation of detention. So, uh, in addition to the mental health problems related to war zones or to trauma that they had in their country of origin on their, during their trip, they've been facing an increase of mental health problems because of the detention. Until now, detention has not been allowed longer than 18 months. But as of April 1st, the detainees can look forward to a detention period, which has been prolonged without limits. This worries Doctors Without Borders, who are already concerned about the living conditions of the detainees. I will mention the case of a person that he, in order to, 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 to bring the attention because he was desperate, he jumped from the roof of the detention center and both his legs were broken. So he was taken to the hospital and then after providing the assistance and you know they fixed the problem, they brought him back to the detention center. The Ministry of Public Order and Citizen Protection, who are in charge of the detention facilities, has not been willing to participate in this feature.